Hello everyone, my name is Hilda and welcome back to my channel. So today we're doing a journaling spread um, because I still haven't done the spread of my birthday weekend. So uh, let's get into it because that was July 24th and we are now August. So high time, I make the spread. I have my trusty journaling TN with me. I have some glue roller. Uh, it's a maxi power tape by Tombo. I have my skull scissors. This is the uh, insert by um, Journal This, and this is their sticker release paper one, which I like more uh, than the actual official um, Traveler's Notebook one. And then I have a whole bunch of ephemera and printed pictures and yeah, let's just get into it.
these are the spreads I did in the end. Um, I, I quit filming this because it's so boiling hot and I had to open the windows. Now I've had to close them again because otherwise you can hear so much noise outside. So yeah, um, quick recap. This was not the train we were on. This was a train full of graffiti, which was on the other track before ours arrived. I really liked it, so I took a picture. Um, and then here's Beth with my parasol for a second so we could see what was on the message somebody sent him. And I put some little labels in. The day before my birthday on the Saturday, July 23rd, we went to uh, Bolkesfest in Antwerp. It's kind of like a, a small beer festival in the middle of the town. And I took one of those, um, you know, the little felt like cardboard cards you put your beer on, a coaster. <laughs> and I carefully pulled off the top bit, so I just had the print of it. And it, um, it worked out really, really well. <laughs> of course, I had to cut it to size to fit in here. And this was a ticket. It says Tallship Races 2022, because the Tallship Races were also happening, but we did not go. And um, yeah, you just had to put money on. And then I wrote a little text, which is a lot of text for my doing. And this was just Bert at um, our table at Hirun Plaas. And here he was waiting for sushi to arrive and eating sushi. Delicious, delicious sushi. Sushi, wow, words. And this is a, a label from one of my yuzu gummy candies. It was the first time I bought the yuzu ones. Normally I get the watermelon ones, but the yuzu are even more delicious. Oh my God, I must buy another pack. This is my birthday spread. Um, yeah, this is not my Halloween journal, but I had a Halloween typey birthday as was to be expected. So I still wanted to add a spread in here and um, I will, you know, off screen, have a, uh, done another spread in my Halloween journal, um, which obviously you will see once that insert is full and I'll do a flip through. Um, yeah. Um, so this is just like my birthday picture. I take one every year and this one came out super funny um, and super fun. I loved it. So that of course had to go in and it's no longer square as is the actual original picture, but it's fine because I fit in the frame. But um, I still had some of these comics frames uh, on my Instax Evo and I really wanted one of those because these are my favorite frames. Um, and then I added some pumpkin um, PET stickers, was from a PET tape by Kiruko Studios. And this was my cake, which was a, it's just a, a strawberry pie really. And then we did the spider web design. Well, I put the spider web design on because it was like, no, that's something you'll have to do. And I put a butterfly, well, it's more of a moth, I believe. Yeah, so like a kind of a lunar moth not realistic, obviously. And I got this in a pack from October 31st, but I wanted like this on here to keep kind of in style here where I use like butterflies. And then these are just bits of origami paper from that big block I have from Sustra and Grena. And it's just this guy, super, super handy. And you get lots of different designs because they're, as you can see, double printed, very, very, very practical for journaling. I should buy an extra of those blocks because it's just really cool. And then this is from Little Spook Studio, I believe. I might have gotten the name wrong, but it will be on screen and in the description. This is one of my little block printed jack-o'-lanterns. And this is from a notepad I got from a friend ages ago. It's from Tokyo Disney Resort. But um, yeah, I wanted to add it because it's just super cute. I am, I'm very stingy with these pages, so <laughs> they only come out for journaling now once in a while. And yeah, that was all of it. I uh, hope you enjoyed watching me faff about and struggle <laughs> putting these together. Um, let me know in the comments down below. Did you journal along with me? Do you enjoy making um, journaling pages as well, spreads? What's your spread style? Uh, or just leave a comment, full stop. If you do leave a comment, please be kind. Subscribe for more shenanigans in motion. Hit that notification bell so YouTube hopefully actually tells you when I upload a new video. 
Song of the day is Grim Grinning Ghosts, the bare naked ladies version, because that one's my favorite. Um, there will, of course, be cute cat content as soon as I've stopped talking. Today, there is Salem watching a video, a Halloween video, no less. So I feel that is a very fitting considering this Halloween-y part of my birthday weekend spread. Uh, the video he's watching is one by my friend Marsh, Halloween homemaker. And you should totally, totally, totally check out their content because it is amazing. And I will, of course, link to them and their video, which is super cool. So check them out. And yeah, that was it for today. I will stop waffling. Hopefully, I'll see you in the next one. Bye!